Hello everyone. Welcome to Statistics Bio 7 YouTube channel. I am Dr. Mohanath Nari. Now we are the discuss topic how to calculate a Pearson correlation in Crapite Pearson software. Okay, what is the Pearson correlations? The Pearson correlation, the correlation is a statistical measures that the describes the extent to which two variables change to other. It indicates the whether there is a linear relationship between the two variables and the directions, the positive or negative of the relationship. The most common measures of the correlation is the Pearson correlation coefficients. The Pearson correlation coefficients are the measure the strength and the direction of the linear relationship between the two continuous variables. The R range from minus 1 to 1. The R is equal to 1 indicates a perfect positive linear relationship. Okay, the next. The R is equal to minus 1 indicates a perfect negative linear relationship. The R is equal to 0 that suggest the no linear correlations. The Pearson correlation coefficients, the positive correlations, the when one variable increase, the other tends to also increase. The zero less than or less than one. Okay, the negative correlations, when one variable increase, the other tends to the decrease. The minus one less than or less than zero. The no correlations. When changes in one variable do not predict changes in the other, the R is equal to zero. The strength of correlations, the closer R is to one or minus one. The strength of the correlations, the closer R is to the zero, the weaker correlations. Okay, the Pearson correlation, the scatter plot. The visual representation of the relationship between the two variables. The points cluster around in a line indicate a stronger correlations. The Spearman and the Candle correlations, alternative correlations measures suitable for the non-linear relationship or ranked data. Okay, go to the data sheet. Okay, this is the data sheet for already entered in the Excel sheet. We take the for the soil nitrogen and the phosphorus level. Total the 14 datas. Okay, the nitrogen the unit for kg for hectare. Okay, this is for the nitrogen value and this is for the phosphorus value in the soil samples. Okay, this data copy paste to the crop aid PSM software. Okay, they select the nitrogen and the phosphorus data set. Copy. Go to the crop aid PSM software. Okay, the created XY under the, the data table. The first one selected, the enter or import data into the new table. Okay, the next one options for the X is a number. The Y option selected the first options, enter under the plot a single Y value for the each point. Okay, then click the created button. Okay, this is for worksheet for the graph aid PSM software. Okay, they select the Excel and the paste the data. Okay, they paste the data. Okay, now the data enter to the crop aid PSM software. Okay, the 40 data, the soil, nitrogen and the phosphorus menu. Now the analyzer for the correlation analysis. Okay, the, this is for the analysis the, the dose data. Click this button. Okay, open the new data for the analysis the data. Okay, the, now the selected for the X, Y analysis. Okay, this is for the correlation. Select the correlation. The data for Y value for the phosphorus kilogram per hectare. Okay, this, uh, click, check the uh, tick mark in the box. Okay, then click the OK button. Now the open the new tab for the parameter in the correlations. Okay, this is for the three options. The compute R for the every pair of the Y data set. Okay, now the selected for the compute R between the to select the data set okay this option selected now this is because i selected to the two data x is for the nitrogen the ohs for the 
phosphorus in the soil samples okay the x for the nitrogen and p for the uh, phosphorus okay the next for the assume the data are sampled from the guess in the distributions yes the computer the pearson correlation now they select calculate for the pearson correlation so select these options next one for the options for the p value the one tile two tiles now they choose for the two tiles next for the conference interval value the 95 percentage okay the next for the output options the p value style because um, graphite psm software in the four type of p value i uh, selected for the gp okay next click for the okay button now the calculate for the pearson correlation in the graphite psm software the nitrogen with the phosphorus kilogram per the hectare okay the pearson r value the r value 0 0.1473 okay this is a positive correlated okay the 95 percentage of confidence interval level minus 0 0.1721 to 0 0.4387 okay the next the r square value this is a positive r square value 0 0.02171 okay the next one for the p value in the two tiles the 0 0.3643 and the p-value summary for the no significance ns the significant alpha for the 0 0.05 no okay the next for the number of xy the pairs is total for the samples in the 40 okay this is for the nitrogen and phosphorus the, this is a statistically correlated positive correlated okay the next for the created in the scatter plot okay this is for the graphs option selected for the already created in the xy data and the correlation data set click this option so open the for the correlation data set in the nitrogen phosphorus okay select the delete the titles now the increase for the graph choose options page to fit okay this is for the nitrogen and the phosphorus for the x-axis nitrogen and y-axis the phosphorus value okay double click for the symbol open the new tab for the format of the graph okay now the correlation data xy data this is for the show the simple color select the color i select the red color okay i choose now green okay then apply now the change for the color in the green next save for the size anyone size any different color size is save for the choose the options okay now the size is auto 9 okay 10 okay 10 this is for the options then click the ok button okay the next one for the format of the graph next to the format of the x's select the format of the x's okay now the created for the frame style the plain frame then apply okay the plain frame created okay now the change the font style i choose the time roman 18 and also the xss value changed to the 18 and the time roman same the y axis value change the font to the time roman and 18 phosphorus for the kilogram per hectare also change the font okay this is for the starter plot in the Pearson correlation coefficients in the graphite Pearson software. The XSS value for the nitrogen kilogram per hectare and the Y axis range for the phosphorus kilogram per the hectare. Okay, thank you for watching this video. If you have any doubt, leave me the comments in the comment box. I will help you. Thank you.